Good morning, I'm Trish Pahanik and this is Synopsis, your first early morning briefing. Today is Tuesday, November 18th, 2008. Here are today's top stories. Politicians continue to equate huge viewer tune-in as CBS 60 Minutes this past Sunday proves. The November 16th program containing the first interview with President-elect Barack Obama and future First Lady Michelle Obama attracted the news magazine's biggest audience since January 1999. 60 Minutes aired from 7.30 to 8.30 due to NFL on CBS running over and during this hour delivered an 8.219 among adults 25 to 54, 6.416 with adults 18 to 49, and approximately 24.49 million viewers. These numbers are still tentative. Final national ratings will be available later on this week. CBS Television Distribution sold two of CBS procedural crime dramas, Numbers, and Criminal Minds into off-network weekend broadcast syndication starting fall 2010. Both shows were picked up by the CBS Television Station Groups in addition to stations from Gannett Broadcasting Group, Belo Corporation, Meredith Broadcasting Group, Cox Television, and Lynn Television, as well as others. Both series have been cleared in all top 20 markets. Across the country, Numbers to date is sold in 90% of the U.S and Criminal Minds is sold in 95% of the U.S. Joan Cusack also has a project in the pipeline for NBC Sites THR. She's developing a comedy about psychiatry based on her own idea in collaboration with the network and Universal Media Studios. Veteran actor Brian Dennehy will co-star with Donnie Wahlberg in TNT's drama pilot Bunker Hill per THR. The pilot about crime and corruption produced by Warner Horizon Television is set in the Bunker Hill area of Boston with Wahlberg portraying a cop who returns to his childhood home and Dennehy playing a former mobster who now runs a flower shop. And the Golf Channel tapped Scott Walker as on-air anchor and reporter for Golf Central, the network's nightly news program. In addition, Scott will be involved with the network's reporting team at PGA Tour and LPGA Tour matches. Well, that's going to do it. Be sure to check your email for the full printed version of today's synopsis with new executive moves and more on ratings, a few new classified ads, and a few of the stories that did not make it into this podcast, and of course, tonight's primetime broadcast lineup. This is a Synopsis Media production in association with 311 West. For Cynthia Turner, who wrote and compiled Synopsis in Connecticut, I'm Trish Pahanek. I'm going to have a good day. Even if I make it myself, I'm going to have a good day. I don't need no one else. I'm gonna have a good day. Nothing wrong I could do. I'm gonna have a good day. Hope you have a good day too.